I suppose uh, how we came to be came about um, actually looking at uh, security screens and that because I said to my wife that you know I think it was time we up, actually upgraded the the original sliding screens to these screens, the security screens. Well, my wife made, made a few phone calls, three, three different uh, suppliers she rang. I then engaged those people to do the the install, paid a deposit. Uh, they came out. I think it was about three weeks later, did the install um, and when I got home I went to close the, the, the two rear glass sliding panels and they were interlocking on, on the sliding frame onto the fixed frame. So I said to my wife, I said, this ain't right, there's something definitely wrong here. I rang him and he said, look, there's, the doors were catching. And I said, well, not as bad as what they are now. I said, it's, it's actually a lot worse than what it was. I mean, yet yeah, we used to use a little bit of uh, elbow to, to close them. As, as you can understand, they're, they're wall to ceiling glass doors, glass panels, you know. So anyway, um, he said, oh, you really need to have the, the rollers of the doors looked at. So then I made the, the contact with Jason's. The gentleman came out um, and went over the doors and basically he couldn't understand why it was actually catching until he actually stepped outside and had a look between the screen door and the actual frame and it actually had small pieces of metal uh, used as packers which was actually throwing the doors in the opposite directions, hence the two panels catching on the frames. Well, because I I wasn't uh, satisfied with uh, the end product that I'd got, I then got back to uh, the, the, the original installers. They sent someone out, uh, the original installer, to come out again. I said I'd had Jason's out. There was nothing wrong with it. Due to the, the, uh, the panels actually being, or having wedges in there, it was causing the problem with the glass panels not not closing. It was nothing to do with the rollers themselves, which I was originally told. I met up with the, the gentleman out here, and he said, "Oh, look, this uh, you know this, this this is how we we've been basically shown how to do these things for the installs." I said, "Right." I said, "Well." you know, what about the, the bottom running track? He said, well, that's, that's generally what we do to make them fit. I still wasn't happy with the fact that that actually altered the structure of the running track at the base of it to accommodate a door, a security screen that should have fitted perfectly, especially for the amount of money that you're actually paying for these, for these doors. Knowing what I know now, um, I would obviously go through Jason windows uh, for any future, you know, installs. Uh, for the simple fact that these screen doors they don't suit that type of running track. So the only the only door that does suit a Jason's track is a Jason security screen.